Hmm. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Bro, I, I just fucking... I, I just had to. I had to. So, I started to recently read the Ren and Girlfriend manga, and, um... I'm not gonna say I love it, because that just makes me sound like a fucking nerd. But I fucking love it. For some reason, I have a weird urge to not only watch, but read a manga that involves five bitches slobbering all over the main character's penis, basically. This will contain manga spoilers. Wait a minute. FBI, open up! Now, I'm also not gonna sit here and say I'm in love with any of these anime characters. Or am I? I mean, look, okay, let's take a look at vo volume one, okay? I just bought this shit the other day. I got it off of Amazon. I mean, like, it's one of many. Just like many other individuals, I started off by just watching the anime, you know? I was I was a simple soul. I went on to Crunchyroll. I, I searched up Random Girlfriend and I started to watch the anime. And guess what? Here I am now, reading the manga. And because I'm very impatient, um, I began to read the manga. But come on, the manga is so good. I mean, who wouldn't like the manga? Like, come on now. Currently, there's only 171 chapters. I've read all of them in a span of a week. Like, who would have thought that me, like, me guys, okay? Do you guys know who I am? I'm the most badass motherfucker known to mankind. I don't cry for shit. I don't eat shit, but I take in shit. Just like how it was whenever I was watching Bunny Girl Senpai, I began to cry a few tears when I was reading the manga for Rinna Girlfriend. Honestly, it's kind of funny because right now the anime, it's kind of like all like happy and stuff. But then like now in the manga, it, it's, it's somewhat sad. Honestly, I hope nobody who doesn't read the manga is watching this video, but I can't, I can't stop that now at this point. And come on, just tell me, how can you not like these people? Honestly, guys, would you believe me if I said this is the first book I've ever bought and read? Actually, I didn't even read this book. I, I, I read the, the stuff online. <sighs> Do you smell that Rena girlfriend? Look, I just, I just may sound like a loser, a virgin, someone who has never drowned in pussy before. And guess what? You're right. I do not know the feel of a woman's touch. The closest thing that I can get to the feel of a woman's touch is by touching the cover of this book. Also, for some reason, lately, I've just been liking a lot of uh, slice of life type anime. I don't know why. And now I like to, I, I got into reading manga. Honestly, the only reason I really started to read this manga was because I'm too impatient to wait for season two of Rent a Girlfriend. If I'm being realistic now, when the fuck did Rent a Girlfriend even end? Okay. Okay, the manga, um, I mean, the. All right, the anime ended on September 25th, okay? We're in what, January? Right? It's been about four months, okay? It's been about four months, and I, I feel like I've been waiting for years. Look, man, waiting for so long, like, look, man, waiting for that long, it just made me so impatient. Why am I even still talking about why I read the manga when you don't even need this much explanation? Some of my favorite parts about this manga would probably be everything. In all seriousness, my favorite part would probably be... If I say the art style, I feel like that would just be too generic. It kind of sounds like a pussy. Like, I'm being too much of a little bitch to give my real cri cri criticism. I Honestly, I just like the way the, the characters interact. That's probably my favorite thing. Like that bitch, whatever her name is. I'm not even talking about mommy. I'm talking about fucking... I don't know her name. That short-ass bitch that's the main character's girlfriend. She's... It's on my nerves. Bro, she's annoying as hell. Okay, you guys are over here sitting like, I hate, I hate mommy because uh, all of you seen is the first season. But like, honestly, in the manga, they, they, they show uh, the character's feelings a lot better than what they do in the anime. At least that's what, that's what I noticed. And then right now, I feel like we've gotten to like the climax. And for some reason, every single chapter I was reading, I always felt like, 
the next chapter can't top this chapter and it does like for an example you have mommy who followed kazuya's grandma on twitter you already know what she's planning to do she's gonna tell her about she's gonna she's gonna tell her about chizuru and her fucking rent, rental girlfriend job on top of that that's not even the worst of it she if you remember in in the in the first season she mommy told chizuru to stop hanging around with kazuya which obviously she fucking doesn't and mommy goes to to kazuya's house and she sees she opens the door the door's unlocked and she sees a purse in his room i'm not gonna explain what happened in case you had you in case for some reason you're an only anime watcher but you know okay but for real like i'm about to i'm about to spoil some shit so if, if you're an anime only watcher please stop watching and then there's this one chapter where where Chizuru's grandma passes away and, and Kazuya is taking her out on a date to try to cheer her up. And Chizuru is acting all cheerful, blah, blah, blah. You know how she is. She doesn't really show emotions. And then towards the end of the of the date, when, when Kazuya kind of expresses his feelings towards her, but not really because, you know, it's fucking manga. She starts to, she just, she just lets it all out. She, she starts to cry a lot, blah, blah, blah. Like... I'm gonna say that made me cry. I ain't no bitch. But I have feelings too, man. Come on now. And of course, I'm just waiting to see what happens. But yeah, I kind of just nerded out for the past few minutes. I don't even don't even really know what I what I was talking about myself. But anyways, I'm in love with the rental girlfriend manga. I'm gonna go rent a girlfriend right now as we speak on egirl.gg. It's basically the same thing. Maybe I can find true love through that this manga is giving me hope but yeah i hope you guys have a wonderful day honestly next time you you see me i'll probably have like two or three more chapters or or novels or volumes i mean this is just the first now i'm gonna get the second i'm gonna get the third i'm gonna get the fourth and i'm gonna stop at the fifth but then i'm gonna get the six but it's okay this is just a phase i hope after this we're going to naruto manga but yeah Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys want to see more random ass anime videos or manga videos, let me know. And I'll see you guys in the next one.